the voodoo diva and we are hot in the voodoo pot yes it is the month of november which we dedicate in aisea voodoo to the gig day crew if you see the gig you heard now what we're gonna be doing today is showing you how to cook with the spirit of the dead which we call gay day now before we can honor our zaset which is the ancestors in creole we have to make sure that the passageway is clear Okay, we talking about Bang Samedi, Grand Brigitte, Maman Brigitte, Gide Nibo, Papa Gide, and so, so many more. But stay tuned because I'm about to show you how we get down Gide style. First off, you got to have your ingredients. You can't do nothing and start the show without your ingredients. First and foremost, the most important, which is the fish, salt fish, but specifically anchovies, okay? Anchovies can be bought at your local fish market. And what I have it in, in this beautiful bowl, here's a calabash bowl, which we call a kui. We use this to put that, and we'll talk about that in the end. Now, of course you can't have no party with the gator if you do not have bima, 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 biglis, bima. Lots and lots of spices, spices, spice of life, correct? Some of the ancient times, you had to trade spices and silks and furs, so spice is important. Now, these are particularly scotch bonnet peppers. You can use habanero, jalapeno, scotch bonnet, African bird pepper, Carolina red peppers, however you can get the heat, you get it, okay? So, of course, you're going to have to need a good amount of these, okay? Because you're going to be using this to top off that salt fish. Now, we also have some yam roots, some yam roots, okay? Everything with get it deals with the energy of the earth. So, you have to have things accordingly. These yam roots are part of it. You also have... Some sweet potato, baby. Some sweet potatoes, okay? And then, to top off, we have plantain. Plain green plantain. These you can find, again, any type of Spanish market, Jamaican supermarket, any type of Caribbean supermarket, you can get a better buy because you can get your fish, get your roots, what you need, and you'll be ready to go. Okay, of course, also you will need a onion, a yellow onion, because at the end we'll definitely be chopping that up along with the pima, which is the peppers. So make sure you have yourself a whole onion as well. As far as cooking oil is concerned, you're going to need at least some olive oil, some pure olive oil, so that you can be able to get that hot, okay, with those peppers at the end. And I'll show you. So again, just get you some olive oil. It can be extra virgin, whatever makes you happy, as long as you get the cook down. All right. And that is essentially what you will need for ingredients to start the party. So here we're going to be making sure that we cut the actual green plant. And this is the only vegetable out of all of them you're going to need to cut. And you just take each one to each side. And then of course now you're going to need to peel the actual okay peeling off the skin as best as you can be careful of course if you need to wear gloves you need to wear gloves you do what you got to do but it's peeling and making sure that this right here will be nice and soft once it's time to get ready for actually getting this particular dish ready okay so that's what you want to do make sure all this gets peeled off okay again be careful take your time and make sure that this basically gets nice and peeled. So now we are in the great outdoors. And why are we here? Because this is a word of caution. If you do not want your house to be extra smelly and you have poor ventilation in your house or apartment, wherever you live, it is best that you stay outdoors to grill, okay? Because not only is it safe, but also the gay they love when you grill their things. The only thing that's peeled in this case is the plantain. Everything else from the yucca root to the sweet plantain is all still not peeled because we are going to be grilling that bad boy and also that salt fish i showed you earlier is also going to be on the grill so 
you want to make sure at all costs if you can to be able to grill it outdoors if you don't want that smell if you have enough ventilation in your home it should not be a problem for you you can put it in the oven bake it at 400 degrees for about maybe about 15 to 20 minutes and you should be fine but my highest suggestion would be Let's get up on that grill, baby. We George Foreman up in here, okay? So let's get on the grilling segment to show you how it's done. mama it's a party the whole time so you want to go ahead and get the energy right up on the grill and you gotta just uh, get your get your get your down i uh, get your get your get your get your down down i said i'll uh, get your get your down okay so we are back from our grilling session as you can see and we've got all our grilled veggies up in the building now we're going to get that topping going to really give the offerings to the gede now you know you can't do them real i talked about them spices those spices is life so let me show you here what we've got is of course you gotta have your pot right hot in the voodoo pot then you gotta make sure if you got what your onions and pepper pima 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 you chop up those pima okay we talked about the scotch bonnet habanero african bird peppers carolina peppers pepper 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 the more the merrier so we've got that here in a bunch of we've also got some onions because we're going to saute those onions as well this is going to be in the mixture to top off what we have here with our veggies so stay tuned let's do it let's do it let's do it so right now we have our pot hot with our olive oil what we're gonna do is once you've got it at about halfway to what the pot measures get yourself some salt I personally love sea salt and what I'm gonna do is just grind a good amount of the sea salt onto here to get it going before I go ahead and put my onion and peppers okay so that's how we're gonna do that Calish bash bowl you have all of the veggies now you have the of course grilled fish the salted fish the anchovies and what you're gonna do is a portion of your onions and your peppers those raw not cooked in the oil you're gonna go ahead and spread those liberally across the plate okay and then when you're done you go ahead and you get equally a part of your peppers over here okay make sure all that's spread across and then the finale is taking what we sauteed of course in the pot and we are dumping that and making it a whole kind of show we're putting that there we're sauteing that on top like that make sure you get everything from the pot onto there and now you have yourself a katie plate and this is the finished product. 
Okay, to add to mention what you would do in terms of serving it, you would take yourself a candle, whether it be a tea light candle or a candle that stands up. Either way, you put that in the middle and that would be ready, all the way ready to serve to the guidi. On a avec respect, Papa Guidi, Baron Samedi, Grand Brigitte, Mama Brigitte, Guidi Nibo, and all of the gated crew because they are large but here my people is how you cook it up spicy bima for the gady here we are finished product your queen calabash bowls i will have for sale make sure you get your gate gear and hoodie so you can be in style while you cook okay and let's get the party so now, ladies and gentlemen, kings and queens, we have the finished product. What you will always do as you're going to get prepared to serve this to the Gede. Bawon, Brigitte, Gede, Gede Nibo, Papa Gede, all that good stuff. Make sure that you have at least a tea light candle. You can use other candles. That'll be when I do my candle session of how to's. You'll find out. But for the sake of this, you can go ahead and lightly, gently put there a tea light candle. Of course, always lick the wick, turn it on, and say, On est avec respect. Pour tout gede yo, on avec respect, met baron, mama brigitte, grand brigitte, gede nibo, papa gede, kwa, kwa la kwa, kwa de kwa, kwa de vwa kwa, kwa sen bo, yes! Go ahead and get you some with the gede, celebrate your ancestors. It's November after all, go out with a bang for 2021. Go do this, yeah, couple of drinks, you get trans, yeah.